Hello everyone. So I have moved in to my apartment here in South Korea. I am in Gangwon-do province, not Seoul, not Busan. Um, I've, I moved in two days ago on Friday after a week of orientation with Epic. Um, and yeah, I start work tomorrow. <laughs> Which is which is great. I met my co-teacher. He actually um, drove me to Sabuk, which is the town that I uh, that my main school is. Um, I'm actually like right across. I'm like neighbors with the school that I'm teaching <laughs> teaching at. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. I start tomorrow. I'm also nervous because the students are older, but I wanted to teach middle and high school, which I thankfully am able to do. Um, <laughs> but still nerve wracking because it is my first time ever teaching um, a full class. Uh, but we'll see how that goes. Yeah. Um, I walked around the town yesterday and it's really, it's not a huge town, but there are many, many restaurants. Um, apparently like the Sabu Gohan area, which like are the two locations that I'll be teaching at, um, are kind of like the Las Vegas of South Korea because at one point in time the town was known for miners. Which this is information my um my co teacher gave me. I already knew about the casino, but he he kind of told me the history. So at one point a lot of people were miners, and then coal isn't really used anymore. So everyone kind of um, everyone. Well, most people lost their jobs, so it ended up being a very poor area. And then the government built a cas built oh, build built a casino um, a few years back, or probably more than a few years back. But they built a casino, and so that's kind of the main tourist attraction of the area. So there are a lot of hotels here. There are a lot of good uh, places to eat here. Um, and I explored a little bit. There's this wonderful, like, two rivers, or this river that splits into two, um, that is kind of just surrounding the town, which is wonderful because it's, it's so picturesque. Um, I actually, my apartment is positioned right next to the, uh, one of the rivers, so I feel like I'll probably be outside a lot just, like, chilling by the river or, like, Taking a run, maybe. We're, we're gonna try to run. We're gonna try. Not gonna hold, hold any promises. Anyways, um, I had a medical checkup during my orientation. It was actually the first day. We got our blood drawn, um, x rayed, uh, got my chest size, <laughs> my height, which is wrong because I feel like I was probably sta standing incorrectly. Um, but yeah, let's see the results. Um, so, this is, a, this is just a horrible video all together because I don't have a, um, a tripod for my phone and that's what we're using because the camera on my computer sucks. Um, <laughs> but we're gonna make it work. Eventually I'll get a, I'll get a tripod. Um. Oh, I don't like opening it like this. Okay. Where my scissors? Okay, look. It's confidential. I actually had to keep it closed because there was potential that when I... So the first thing I did when I got to Kangwondo, or I was in Donghae when we stopped, um, was we all went to apply for our ARC, which is our alien registration card. And so there was a potential, there was a possibility that I would need my, um, my medical checkup for the application. So I couldn't open it until now. So now it's open. Um, yeah. All right. So good news. There was no Philip Philip. Philippone found in my blood. There was no cocaine. There was no opium. There was no hemp. <laughs> so I'm clean. Um, no drugs here. 
Um, what else? I am 170. Okay, it says I'm 171 here, but I swear I'm 172. I think I was just standing. I, I think I just wasn't standing correctly. Um, 81 kilos. I was really excited about that because, so some of this I already saw, but I was really excited about that because it means I didn't gain weight on the plane right over. They kept like waking us up to feed us and then would turn the lights off and then I'd knock out. So I'm actually really happy I didn't gain weight. Um, my eyes are apparently really, really horrible. So this one is like 1.5 and this one is 0.9. I don't know <laughs> exactly what the what the conversion is for like the American scale, but like that it was it's such a bad it's such a big difference um my chest size my chest circumference um is 99 centimeters <laughs> i think that's all they really gave me yeah yeah but there it is that's my uh that's my everything i was actually really excited to find out like Something about my blood. I wanted to... They t they drew our blood. And I really wanted to know, like, what my... Um... Blood type was. But it doesn't seem... Like... They did that. So, yeah. Okay, well... And that's it for this video. I will update you guys after a week of teaching. Um, still got a lot of unpacking to do, so hopefully I finish that by the time I do my next video. And maybe I'll even buy a tripod for this camera. <laughs> Alright, bye.